Hello students, let's continue our journey through Algebraic Expressions and Identities. Today, we are going to open up a new topic, Identity. We know the multiplication of a polynomial by a polynomial. A plus 2 and A plus 3 are two binomials. By multiplying, A plus 2 multiplied by A plus 3 equals A multiplied by a plus 3 plus 2 multiplied by a plus 3 equals a multiplied by a plus a multiplied by 3 plus 2 multiplied by a plus 2 multiplied by 3 equals a square plus 3a plus 2a plus 6 adding like terms we get a square plus 5a plus 6 that is we get equality a plus 2 multiplied by a plus 3 equals a square plus 5 a plus 6. If we put a equals 1, the LHS of the equation becomes LHS equals a plus 2 multiplied by a plus 3 equals 1 plus 2 multiplied by 1 plus 3 equals 3 multiplied by 4 equals 12. That is, LHS equals 12. And RHS becomes RHS equals a square plus 5a plus 6 equals 1 square plus 5 multiplied by 1 plus 6 equals 1 plus 5 plus 6 equals 12. That is, RHS also equals 12. Therefore, LHS equals RHS. That is, 4a equals 1, the LHS and the RHS of the equality are equal. If we put a equals minus 2, LHS equals a plus 2 multiplied by a plus 3 equals minus 2 plus 2 multiplied by minus 2 plus 3 equals 0 multiplied by 1 equals 0. And RHS equals a square plus 5a plus 6 equals minus 2 the whole square plus 5 multiplied by minus 2 plus 6 equals 4 minus 10 plus 6 equals 0. That is, LHS equals RHS. Therefore, 4A is equals minus 2, the LHS and RHS are equal. We found that, for any value of A, LHS equals RHS. An equality that is true for every value of the variable in it is called an identity. So we can say that the equality of plus 2 multiplied by a plus 3 equals a square plus 5 a plus 6 is an identity. All identities are equations, but all equations may not be identities. Consider the equation a square plus 5 a plus 6 equals 12. We have seen that, the given equation is true for, a equals 1. But when we take, a equals minus 2, the value of the equation, a square, plus 5a plus 6, becomes 0. That is, it is not true for a equals minus 2. Similarly, the equation, a square plus 5a plus 6 is equal to 0, is true for, a equals minus 2, but it is not true for a equals 1. That is, we can say that, in general, an equation is true only for certain values of the variable in it. It is not true for all values of the variable. If the equation is true for all values of the variable, then it is called an identity. Some of the identities that we will discuss in this chapter are a plus b the whole square equals a square plus 2ab plus b square. A minus b the whole square equals a square minus 2ab plus b square. a plus b into a minus b equals a square minus b square. x plus a into x plus b equals x square plus a plus b into x plus ab. Let's see the details of them in the coming classes. Let's recall what we discussed today. 
identity is an equality that is true for every value of the variable in it. Before winding up, let's check how much you understood by doing an activity. Check whether which of the given values are true for the equation a square minus 3a plus 6 is equal to 10. Minus 3, 4, minus 1, and 2. That's all for now. See you in the next class.